Daylight saving time was trialled in the state of Queensland, Australia, during the 1989–90 season, with the trial extended for a further two years—1990–91 and 1991–92. The last full day of daylight saving in Queensland was Saturday, the 29th of February 1992, with clocks officially wound back an hour on Sunday, the 1st of March at 3 a.m. Topic: <laughs> Daylight Saving Task Force. During the initial one-year trial in 1989–90, a Daylight Saving Task Force was appointed to monitor and report community opinions, as well as provide recommendations to the Queensland Government. The task force made five recommendations, of which only two were implemented, these being, the extension of the Daylight Saving Trial for a further two years 1991 to and that a statewide referendum be held after the extended Daylight Saving Trial period. The task force had noted that the Brisbane and Moreton regions Southeast Queensland were "...clearly in favour of Daylight Saving." which led them to the following further recommendation, "...that daylight saving be introduced for that part of the state east of 151 degrees east longitude," i.e. a dual time zone arrangement for Queensland. <laughs> <laughs> daylight saving referendum After trialling daylight saving in Queensland for a total of three years, a referendum was held on the 22nd of February 1992, with the question, Are you in favour of daylight saving? and was defeated with a 54.5% no vote. This referendum result displayed the same distinct trend that the task force had recognised that public opinion on daylight saving in Queensland is geographically divided, with the no vote strongest in the north and west regional districts, while the yes vote was strongest in the state's metropolitan southeast. See also Time in Australia Daylight saving time <laughs>